Locals woke up this morning to a winter wonderland, with snow covering a large chunk of the city, including Brockville and Wakari. While some played, others worked, including motivated mailman Ray Knox. Um, well, we've got our full round to do, and quite a few of us are actually doing extra today because we're a bit short-staffed, but uh, yeah, hopefully they all go all right today. Primary and intermediate schools have had a late start today, with pupils braving the cold to get to class at 10am. Even these fellows behind me are wrapped up warm. Roads and footpaths are icy, so anyone travelling today is urged to be careful. Police say most motorists are taking care, but there's always a small minority that drive dangerously and create problems. We've had about five minor crashes, uh, including one car in the harbour at Deborah Bay, but generally uh, the locals are starting to realise that uh, it is winter and they are driving to the conditions. Three Mile Hill was closed for most of the morning, with the road opening just before midday, and warnings have been in place for other roads around the city. Meteorologists say there's potential for black ice to form overnight, as temperatures drop into the negatives, and that's prompting further warnings from police. Listen to the forecast, and make sure if you're working, you have a snow plan with your boss, and your boss has a snow plan with you. So whether you need to come in or can come in a bit later, have something in place. This snowfall is being blamed on some unusually energetic weather systems, and that's also brought the recent flooding. It's unlikely the city will get any further significant snowfall this week, but residents are urged to stay prepared, especially for frosty mornings. David DeLorean, 39, Dunedin News.